Good evening. Two things I will uh, mention on this chart. Again, <laughs> this is a five-day chart going back to Sunday night. And basically, you see Sunday we opened right here at uh, 1027, and we're trading right now at 1028. So this entire week, we've had these herky-jerky, look, look at these moves. We had one sharp move up to uh, 35, one sharp move down to 20, uh, called 19. One sharp move up to 1038, another sharp move down here to uh, 1022. Back quickly to uh, yeah, a spike here uh, of 10.32, back to 10.21, back to 10.20, back to 10.30, back to 10.15 today, this morning. And then in three hours, we uh, grinded right back up to 10.33, now right back to 10.28. So all this, folks, just to uh, see right where we started on the week, 10.27. So uh, we have, uh, in the entire week, uh, if you came in along, you're up one point. If you came in short, you're down one one point. So, all this is uh, again typical end of the uh, summer trading. Next week is a Labor Day week. Tomorrow is Friday. I really am. Uh, I'm going to be out playing golf. Enjoy yourselves if you must trade, and uh, be careful out there. And again, same story. Buy uh, down towards 10:18 with a stop at 10:14, and uh, sell at 10:35 with a stop at 10:41, and uh, keep it straight and keep it real and I'm going to try to do the same out there on the uh, golf course tomorrow so be careful oil uh, back down this uh, today you've got uh, it was down on the open and then rallied to the close banks uh, same thing open down came up into the close everything is moving in concert illiquid volume uh, big volume here on the south and then little volume all day and then yet they took it all the way up advancers decliners finally caught up to about break even and we as we ended the day basically about plus two for the day after all that uh, rigmarole. So that's it. Have a great trading day tomorrow. We'll see you uh, Monday. Look for a, another mistrade missive, an interview that we did uh, with Francine McKenna of Re the Auditors. So uh, look for that tomorrow. It's a really nice interview. Enjoyed talking with Francine, and I think you'll look forward to it uh, from a trader and investor.